Now, Delama 182 has requested that we do something Asian. And Matete has requested more ethnic food. So we're going to do a really quick, really fast-paced, crispy Chinese beef and nice refreshing uh, cucumber salad. We're going to show you all the stuff you need to make the dressing and some rice as well. Lovely. Okay, so yes. first things first, um, we're going to get a pan on. I'm just going to dry roast some cashew nuts. Okay, so there's fantastic nuts in there and they're just going to go in and if you can just keep an eye on them every so often, just give them a bit of a toss in the pan so okay. they're nice and golden. Give them a good job, it's nice and easy. Toasted nuts are so much nicer. Am I going to do this? Yeah, you can. So much more flavour. Yep. Cucumber, do you know what to do with that? What I need you to do is <laughs> peel it. <laughs> okay. It's something unusual actually, because what we're going to do is peel it. So you just keep peeling all the way down and we want lots and lots of these lovely strips because that's going to form the base of our salad. I've if you pop those like before, into though. a bowl. No, it's not unusual. And when you get to that point, Baz, if you yep. turn it round, you don't want too much of this pithy bit in the middle and start from the other side. You okay. want loads of green colour without too much of that middle bit. At this point, I'm just going to show you a really handy tip to make simple, tasty rice. If you grab a bit of root ginger, take a couple of pieces off like this, and just pop it in with the rice as you boil it. So I've just got some jasmine rice and some salted water. Just the flavour. And it's rice. just enough flavour just to infuse that rice without taking over. It's really subtle. Meanwhile, we've got these lovely beef steaks. What I need to do is I'm going to plate these beef and I just want you to pop them in here with some corn flour. Okay, and I'm going to flavour our beef with Chinese five spice. Okay, okay so in here you've got some fantastic flavours. Ben, what do I do with the pits? Uh, save that, I'll show you in a minute. We won't waste it. It's a great thing about that. As I strip these beef, if you can just give those a toss in there so they get all nicely coated mm. into our Chinese five spice corn flour mix. So we're going to fry them a little bit and that's what makes it crispy. Mm. That's better. A bit more beef. That's it. Actually, that looks good. Coated. And a little bit of salt. So your cucumbers all stripped up. Yep. What we need is a quick dressing. So a little glug of oil. Mm -hmm. You grab a fork and mix all these together as we go. A little glug of sesame oil. Sesame. A little bit of soy sauce. Mm -hmm. Squeeze mm. of lime. So it's some nice fresh flavours. So as with all dressings, you want to balance the oil with the shark and the vinegar, which is where this bit comes in. Plenty of lunge. In the pan, Michael! Full of the cashew nuts. Are you, you're not going to eat that. Put it in your mouth. Put it in your mouth in front Don't of Don't peer pressure me! Do it. And you did it. What a filthy animal. While you're doing that, I'm chopping up a little bit of chilli. There's no chilli in the fire spice. Mm -hmm. um, instead, we've got the chilli in the dressing. So that's going to go in there. So that'll be plenty. And some fresh coriander into that dressing. And then if you put that all over your cucumber, if the nuts are done, just pop them into there. Nice and hot pan for this next bit. And this yeah. is crucial because we want to get nice and crispy beef. So I've got the nice green bits of spring onion, which we'll use just to finish off later on. But now, nice hot pan, a little bit of oil. Sorry, carry on. That beef that you've done there, I'm just going to toss that from hand to hand. It's hot. And then we're just going to put it in here. Give it a flip. A little bit more. Mm -hmm. Make sure it's nice and crispy before you flip it over. So nice and, you've got nice and mm. seamless now, crispy, that's where the corn flour goes, nice and crispy. Can all that kind it. of flavour. Yep. Make sure when you do it, you get all these bits coated. Mm -hmm. You don't want any raw flour in there. we will keep mm. frying that for a bit longer. Smells At this brilliant. point, I'm going to put the spring onions in as well, because they just want a couple of minutes to soften up. This is very vibrant, this one, isn't it? So much colour. And actually, if you guys do this dish at home, and you want to take loads of photos of it, and you want to see all those vibrant photos, so please do share them on our Facebook page. The link is in the description box below. Otherwise, if you can drain that rice first, because that. that's nearly there. Ben, yeah. what do I do with this? Um, <laughs> oh. <laughs> that'll do. Well, actually, if you've got a little bit of dressing left, a cucumber left, just dip it in and eat it for yourself. It's not quite as pretty as these ribbons, but it's still just as tasty. And that's the beauty of this Asian cooking, is it gets thrown together so quickly. Mm -hmm. Rice, fantastic. Do you want to take these bits out then, now? Yep, take out the ginger, so it's just done its flavour of infusing it, that's all we needed. This fantastic jasmine rice, yeah, slight great. gingerness coming through there. It's like my beard. <laughs> is this gluten free as well? Gluten free and lacto free. Ah, so for all you people who are asking for those. Loads of our beef on there, and then our really fresh zingy cucumber salad. Mm -hmm. So Ooh, for there. Delama 182 who wanted something Asian, and Matete who wanted something ethnic, I think that pretty much does it. It's our oh, crispy yeah. Chinese beef with a cucumber salad, sorted. Mmm. Pretty crunchy. Crispy beef. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. Mm. This is delicious. I'm loving you should salad. make this if you're listening. 